it's Cape Town. It's the heart of the CBD. We're probably yeah. about 100 meters from the, the center of, uh, of Cape Town. If you look at it on a map, it's 91 Loop Street. And uh, that's us. And I was talking to Glenn, one of our partners from Joburg, in a, in a hostel, in a bar hostel in Cape in Sydney called Wake Up. Uh, and we were down there, and we were discussing how cool that bar was, and how cool that hostel was. And Glenn leans over at two in the morning and says, "Hey, Sam, what do you think about starting a hostel like this in Cape Town?" And I said, "That sounds like a great plan, like you do at two thirty in the morning." And two years ago, now we were here. St. Patrick's Day, so we were completely sober, uh, checking this out, and uh, yeah, it was a hairdresser, a convenience store, a warehouse, and small backpackers, and uh, so we, we got to work, and uh, we opened up in uh, December, and uh, we're four months now in the making, and uh, yeah, we still got a little bit to go, but uh, it's shaping up, and uh, we're here to uh, introduce it to you. Oh, I mean, I think the, tr the youth travel industry specifically is built around uh, you know, contacts between people. Uh, it's built around a lot of events like this, people hanging at a bar, having a beer, talking. I mean, that's like 91 Loop Street is in essence all about that kind. That's how we started. Tonight is a very interesting night for me because I have never been to a place like this. I've been to a lot of ho uh, hostels and a lot of hotels in my trips, but I've never seen something this... 3D, you know, it's very light, it's very big. I have a blog that is called superjab.com and I make weekly vlogs of my adventures around the world. I've been traveling for the last 18 months, more or less. I've been across Central and South America, documenting my trip on a weekly basis with my vlogs. And now I'm here in Cape Town. I'm loving the city so much. So my name is Francesca. I'm an Italian travel blogger. Actually, I'm a travel psychologist and I do travel coaching and, and I wrote on a website that is called Viaggiare da Soli, that means uh, traveling alone. In this kind of event, you can uh, meet other people that work in the same industry but in another city and you can also like um, figure out what's going on. So I really like this hostel, has a very good vibe and some new aspect for like for example the capsule beds they are very new this is my uh, humble abode so it's fantastic if you really want to look at it it's just really comfy so <laughs> sorry um, yeah this is the future of, uh, of hostels I think it's fantastic uh, I was very impressed when you enter into the room the light of your own pods lights up because I think it's a very nice feature. Yeah, nights like tonight um, bring a whole bunch of people together and basically they can focus on um, uh, Cape Town and uh, bring people together and, and uh, basically bring people from all over the world. I think it's important to put yourself in, in a place where you can meet very like-minded people because not, not only you can have interesting conversation, you can network, but at the same time it could be an opportunity to collaborate on projects together to really understand how things work in a specific city because most of those people come from Cape Town. So thank you for coming. Hope you had a great evening. Hope you want to stay here a little bit longer. Thank you very much. And cut.